get those pucks in front of the net. A couple rebound goals. And uh, if he can tighten that up, maybe get some help from his D, Buckeyes should uh, be better in front of their net. Yeah, Ohio State lost last night 5-2. Pearson turns it puck over. Cherimetta feeds the point. That redirection. Now the rebound. Portillo stops them both. And he's got the puck underneath him. Even during that five-minute major, they didn't convert. They created a lot of chances. There's Lowry. He's one of the key components, number six back there. Right in front. Travis Trelor. Thank you very much. The wraparound. It's a power play goal. Rydell will use the boards to clear. Just four minutes in. Here's Matty Beneers. Slides that pass through it. Dobish forced to make a blocker save. Back on the point. Gabriel unable to keep it in with his skate. Samoskevich the other way. Samoskevich can't get the pass back. Beecher gets the shot off and Dobish the save. Who was reinserted into the lineup for Ohio State tonight. And now the Buckeyes attacking. Thiessen shooting. Portillo the stop. It was an easy one. Puck was pretty much shot right at him. 12.35 to go in this opening period. Matty Beneers angling his way in. Backhand shot. Dobish the save. The rebound is blocked at the defense. Cherimetta trying to clear and takes it wide on Dunlap, but Dunlap stays with him. And Sam Oskevich is a little angered as a result. Now here comes Ohio State attacking. Guzzo ahead. Dunlap right in front. So, hey, you got to bear down, and, and Cooley did a good job of going to the net and then take, take care of the advantage. Oh, turnover. Quinn Preston walking in. Quiz Preston shooting, and Portillo hangs with him, making the save as he was almost gift-wrapped the third goal of the night. A minute to go. This is Matty Beneers. Straight away, Luke Hughes down low. Samuel Skevich in front. Blankenberg scores! Power play goal! Nick Blankenberg waving at the doggy, and Michigan is alive and well. Second period, you see the damage done from Nick Blankenberg. And a fair catch. Six seconds. Now it's Quinn Preston ready to break it out for Ohio State. Flanked by Cherimetta. Right in for the backhand look was Jake Wise. That's gloved down by Eric Portillo. Jake Heronin is now, he can go both ways. He was dressed as the seventh defenseman. So right now you're looking, they still have six. Rebound, they score! Oh, Quinn Preston. How bad did he need that one? The drought is over, and Ohio State has reclaimed the two goal lead. They don't have that big break. So maybe he can get hot. You know, you don't want to score one goal and then, oh, we don't play for a month. Now another opening. Here's Cherimetta. Scores! That didn't take long. Cherimetta make it 4-1 Ohio State. And it's time for the dog our, to our get up dog and We're naming him, naming him Dan Skittles, right? We're, we're, we're self-named Skittles by our... Producer. Good selling, too, from Cherimetta. He had to kind of put the sword away after he scored that goal. Fourth of the season for Mark Cherimetta. I mean, this is definitely a group that scores by committee. The theme continues. Now it's Tate Singleton. Are you serious? Make it 5-1. Had a little talk there to the bench from Tate. Now through the seams, the pass. Morgan. In front on the rebound, Brissaw, Jakob Dobash down on the ice makes the save and a little slash there from Luke Morgan in front as well. well setting the tone for, you know, February, I believe, is when their next series is. They're trying to leave a message for that next time around. Dunlap looking for another one. He's got it. It's 6 1 Ohio State. And you got to. And it's Garrett Van Wy. 
Ben Wise, so dangerous shorthanded with that speed, draws a penalty. Now a little cross check to Sid Locha in the near corner. Great goaltending when needed, and then timely scoring from their fourth line. Really getting it done in all facets tonight for Ohio State. And tonight belongs to Ohio State.